Hi, I'm Ken Myers. I'm a pediatric neurologist and epileptologist. Our paper in the June 2018 issue of DMCN is a long-term study of the safety and efficacy of steropentol in the treatment of seizures in Dravet syndrome. What's known on this topic already is that Dravet syndrome is a severe infantile onset developmental and epileptic encephalopathy. Affected children have multiple seizure types, which may include febrile convulsions, generalized tonic-clonic, focal impaired awareness, myoclonic, and absence seizures. Now, these seizures are often very difficult to control with standard anti-epileptic therapies, and many patients have recurrent bouts of status epilepticus. Steropentol is a medication that has shown efficacy in Dravet syndrome, evidence that comes primarily from two European trials in which steropentol was used as add-on therapy to clobazam and valproate, with no other medications allowed for blinded treatment periods of two months. What's new in our study is that we present long-term safety and efficacy data of steropentol when used as part of unrestricted therapy for treatment periods of up to 11 years. Our data show that approximately 50% of patients with Dravet syndrome will have at least a 50% reduction in seizure frequency, with approximately 40% having at least a 50% reduction in frequency of status epilepticus. In summary, our data indicate that steropentol is safe and effective in Dravet syndrome, even when used long-term as part of unrestricted polytherapy. I hope you enjoy our paper.